All right, Maya has really wanted to do some Ahi tuna fillets because she had it at the restaurant, at our favorite Thai restaurant in Ozark this weekend. And I make them often, but she normally doesn't have them. So um, I just, I usually get them at Aldi. These came from the marketplace. Um, just, I just thaw them in cold water, pre-packaged, and then when they're thawed, take them out of the plastic. And all right, so this is what they look like when they're just like thawed out. And um, ideally I would have everything bagel seasoning because everything bagel seasoning has poppy seeds, sesame seeds, dehydrated garlic, onion, um, this, all the really good stuff. You can, we like to sprinkle it on avocados or toast or egg, but it's really good if you pat one of these fillets dry and then um, coat that in everything bagel seasoning with a little ginger powder or grated ginger and sear it. But I don't have that. So um, what I'm doing, and Maya probably wouldn't prefer it that way anyway because that's not how she had it. So what I did was just um, use the powdered ginger, some onion powder, garlic powder, and a little bit of salt and some um, ground pepper and then you in your cast iron or whatever skillet you use just heat a little bit of olive oil and even less of sesame oil because it's potent and then you just sear that's it so I'll show you that part So maybe it was like more like 50 seconds each side. I'll tell you what the sauce is too. It's kind of a combination of um, poison, oyster, just like half a tablespoon each, some Thai chili sauce, sweet Thai chili sauce, and um, a tablespoon of soy sauce. Some green onions would be good there. And of course the everything bagel seasoning that we don't have. But look how pretty. 